So the first thing I had to do was create a blueprint. For this, I just used Illustrator and traced over a picture of the gun I found online. To estimate the size of the gun, I found some sources online saying Graves was 5 foot 6, so I used that and worked out the size of the gun in relation to the size of Graves. In the end, it ended up being 120cm long, 45cm high and 25cm wide. The first piece I made was the stock, as pretty much everything else needed to be built around that. For this I just used two pieces of 35mm MDF that I had lying around and stuck them together to make them 70mm. few inches later So we've got the details at the back attached and sanded down to the shape that I want now. We've also cut out the trigger guard, cut out some extra bits of wood, added onto it so that I can cut some holes in the main stock and kind of slide it in, like that. And then it should fit nicely. Two hours later. As you can see, the stock is now pretty much done, aside from some finishing and sanding and stuff. So next up is the barrel. That, I've got some oak bowl blanks to make these bits. Some oak spindle blanks for those bits there. And last but not least, either 75mm or 90mm PVC pipe for the barrel. I'm not sure which one I'm going to use yet, to be honest. Just see how it looks when it's all together. So much depends on the price of your eyes. You scratch the diamonds with the sounds of your cries. And in October, I took over.
Okay, so, progress update. The barrel is now pretty much done. We've got the two bowl pieces in there. So we go there and there. And then we've got the actual barrel. Decided to go with 90mm pipe in the end. I think it looks better. And we laid the little tip to go on the end of that as well. Put the spindle that goes along the top, again down the lathe. And then as well as the barrel, we've got these little pieces, which I guess if it actually functioned would probably be the bit to drop the barrel, but it looks good. And then, and then last but not least, we've got the little grip bit at the bottom that goes under the chamber, which we made out of three pieces of MDF to stick together with a groove down the middle. It slots in there. Next thing to do is to make the chamber. Once we've got two sets of three oak bowl blanks to stick together, and those will be those bits there. One of the last things that needs to be done is the grip. For this, I decided to do them all as individual pieces and then stack them all on top of each other. So I've just stuck two pieces of 9mm MDF together to make it 18mm, and then stenciled on a bunch of these pieces. We'll cut them all out and then stick them all together. One eternity later. Now I forgot to video how I made the chamber, so instead you get super professional and detailed slideshow of how to make it. As you can see, all the pieces are now made, it just needs to be painted and put together. There's no screws or anything holding it together, it's all just joints, dowel and glue. I painted all the pieces separately and then put them together afterwards. This clip here is just me testing the construction of it before I painted it to make sure that nothing was out or odd, to make sure everything fit together properly. I did have to make a few adjustments, for example the barrels weren't perfectly straight and the chamber didn't quite fit on properly and the grip underneath didn't quite fit into the two barrels properly, but it was all quite easy stuff to fix. Like photographic monochrome images and semitones make perfect lovers when they're undercover and you're on your way, you're on your way. When I figure out the things I never thought I knew, making reservations for a few.
later that same evening. Yeah. What's up? I feel like I'm missing something, but I can't think what. Why now? There we go. Yeah. You ready? <laughs> hey. Let's go. Back. Yo. Once again, I'm back around. Uh, real shit back in style. Uh, haters reconcile. Uh, I'm so black and proud. First class tickets now. Uh, feet all in the eye. Uh, Everybody looking down, everybody get red when you drown, huh? Look at me up, I'm putting it down, you picking it up Checking the models, they want us to go to college just so we can be stuck Go to school to make a living, or teach yourself to make a fortune Common sense, welcome to the apocalypse, bitch, I'm one of the horsemen I don't need your endorsement, I don't need reinforcement Giving you your last warning, cause I'm at my prime Yeah I'm at my Gone too far? Do you detect something different? If you look inside my head, would you say something's missing? If you could give all your riches just to say the word, would you risk it? <laughs> nah. Thank you, super awkward. I can't do it with a cigar. Nope. If you've made it this far, then thanks a lot for watching. If you want to check out my Instagram for some progress pictures on this project or any upcoming projects, or my website where I did a blog post detailing the process of making the shotgun, then the links for those are either on the screen or in the description. Also in the description, there's links to all the songs I used for making this.